Okay, so doing this stock I bought today. Sorrento Therapeutics stock. Sorrento. Oh yeah, the bottle already. A thousand of them. Oh my god. Sure. Let me think I get some air. I should get classic combination of cool at the same time. So I bought this stock today called Sorrento Therapeutics. I got 940 shares. And I bought it at like 828. So I'm going all over here. Five dollars to twenty dollars from the weekly high to lows. Two thirty eight million dollar market cap, so it's not a small stock. It's not a penny stock. It's under ten dollars, it's not over it's over five. So it started out this morning at nine fifty but fell. So I bought it on the low. So it's got nine hundred and thirty four shares. So if it goes up to more over a dollar, I'll make over a thousand dollars. K two biotech stocks, Wall Street predicts were rallied by more than hundred and fifty percent. So it's a clinical stage of commercial biopharma company engaged in developing therapies for cancer, autoimmune, inflammatory, viral, and non neurodegenerative diseases. The company operates two segments. Center Therapeutics received emergency use approval and report license from Mexico Authority Coppers for its COVID-19 detection drug, which is we launched this month. It should benefit significantly from this launch. We expect to increase 237% year over year. So again, this is not a penny stock. It's over a penny stock. You know, our revenue is expected to increase by 798%. So they rate this a buy. The median price target is $24. So if we want to hold this until I came out on my checking account for a while, because I'm trying to beat well, the means, because I don't want to spend a lot of money right here. I want to spend a lot of money I'm going to go to my next trip, which is probably like California. Cali. I actually have business there beyond what I need to be. So, it rained us to a high 20, 30. So, if it was going to go up to 30, I'd be slapping on this shit and looking at my... If it was really to go back, and I held for a while. So, we like 21.75 times... 934. It'd be like 20 grand. It'd be like, like when I used to have. Like two years ago. Like when I first got 3 grand. So anyways. It's FDA acquaintance for RTX Phase 2 trial. Seriously, Food and Drug Administration requires to proceed with a Phase 2 clinical study of non opioid product candidate Risk for toxin or RTX for knee pain and osteoarthritis. Given the durability of clearance pain and relief in response to RTX, this is a district disclaimer. Strenda decided to include an active comparator tour, injectable caloric effects there in the current trial protocol. Superiority data potentially generated by RTX is a widely used approved drug to be supported for accelerated international registration. And required for pricing purposes in Europe. Next, three stocks expect will trip double or triple in one year. So go here. Not only full. And remember, you gotta watch this article. Not all of them are right. I mean, some of them act like they're experts, and none of them know anywhere you. Not one of them. Some of them are really good. I've been doing this for a while. Um, if you want upside potential. I strongly suggest you get clinical stage biotech drug and diagnosis company. They have a price target over $3027. They're doing a lot of work, work on coronavirus treating. They have 11 COVID-19 programs in various clinical or regulatory stages. The testing being the number one priority. Sorrento filed for emergency use authorization. Which COVID track antibody test June 19, 2020. Expectation is that Sorrento will get the EUAs. Oh my was delayed. These tests could represent a one billion annual sales rep opportunity for Trento for the stable future. The company has a exhaustive pipeline as well as diagnostics team. This includes four clinical stage COVID-19 treatments, six clinical stage 
cancer immunotherapy. Two clinical stage main trials and two clinical trials focused on UAT liver injectable medicines directly into lymphatic and system capillaries. The biggest concern is capital. But I don't know. Honestly, what I've seen. So I'm going to tell you, I'm going to buy some like I did, but I'm going to sling it or drop it. I'm not going to hold it. But I still think it's going to I'm going to do it next. What's next for Sorrento Therapeutic Stock? And your large 50% rise. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to say buy. I'm going to say buy. I'm going to strong buy. I'm going to buy like 300 shares or something. Don't, don't like, like I, I spent a lot in there. But I'm not going to hold it. I'm going to know that I'm going to probably sell it tomorrow and make a grand or the next day. Or maybe the next week. Honestly, I think I think this is a, this is a strong one. I think this is a strong company. So let's see here. Keep going. I think it was five five dollars. Look at high twenty. Go to financials. Annoyed delay. Bought a big price because I bought them at day low. Revenue's up eighty four percent. Net income one hundred three percent. Cash on hand. About ninety percent, cost of revenue hundred percent. So operating income is down that twenty eighty percent. Can't change any cash seven percent, and that is. So here, let's go back to the news. Um, anyways, I'm not. She looks she didn't like it for me. Warren is in therapy for those who don't want to be stabbed with a needle. Warren is the clinical stage biopharma company holding treatment for COVID and cancer and neuro diseases. So after all this, I'm going to say this is a strong buy. This is not a strong buy, I'm going to say it's a buy. Honestly, I think it's a good buy. It's biopharma, which is in right now. But I'm saying buy like 300 I bought 934, but I'm going to sling it for profits the next day.